Weather with meteorologist Ryan Matouche. All right, welcome back everyone and good evening. Hopefully you enjoyed the mostly cloudy skies today and the rain that is now in the viewing area. Personally, I find it refreshing. Yes, it gets in the way of some outdoor activities, but it's a nice little change. Here's what's going on. Satellite and radar keeping an eye on those showers pushing into the viewing area. You can see the general northward trajectory of these showers pushing into northeast Kansas. Some lighter rain moving through the I-70 corridor, including Manhattan and Junction City. Some heavier rainfall on the way approaching Emporia and eventually um, our northern counties too. Now if we zoom out, we can see it's part of a bigger system, basically swirling around Oklahoma. The northern edge is where the most rain is, and we've been watching it for a couple of days, and it's finally here, and it's going to stay through at least the overnight hours. Outside our Junction City camera, just a pleasant evening underway. Very similar outside our West Topeka camera. Pleasant in the sense that it's refreshing. Again, that's my opinion, but it is out there. 47 degrees in Topeka, feels like 44. Winds out of the north northeast, about six miles an hour. More temperatures across the viewing area, highlighting those middle to upper 40s. 48 in Hiawatha, 47 in Emporia, and then again, middle to upper 40s for just about everyone. And I think that's what we're going to be seeing for tomorrow, too. We're not going to be warming up much more than that. Average high for this time of year, 51 degrees. Today we saw 54, so another day above average and another day, uh, in my opinion, that's really just much needed. Winter's right around the corner, so take these 50s while you can. All right, fast forwarding into tomorrow morning, upper 30s to kick things off, lower 40s to the south and the east. Second half of the day, we should be watching upper 40s take over. And then heading into Monday afternoon, even warmer, more middle 50s back in the area. Tuesday, possibly getting close to 60. As far as timing goes, by about 6, 7 o'clock tonight, most, if not all, of northeast Kansas should be seeing at least some rainfall. And then by 10 o'clock, more rain in the area. Some pockets of heavier rain will be possible, mostly for the south and the east. And it's not until early tomorrow morning, 6, 7 o'clock, where some lingering rain showers will remain. And then for the rest of the day, we see partly cloudy skies, a few raindrops trying to hang out in the area and eventually clear skies into Sunday and sunshine for Monday. So this is the main activity for right now and just something we want to keep an eye on. Most of the rainfall will be to the south and the east, about a half inch near Osage and Emporia, Topeka, Manhattan, a little bit closer to a quarter of an inch, maybe a half inch. Showers for tonight, rain in the area, 40s for the next several hours. It will be a little bit on the cooler side with that rain cooled air in the area. Chiefs play tomorrow. Here's what we got 325 kickoff at Arrowhead, 45 degrees to start things, 41 for the post game. It will be a little bit on the windy side. And then we got 47 for our afternoon high. We got 53 on Monday, nearly 60 on Tuesday. That's going to feel wonderful in there before another big cool down on Wednesday. Yeah, 59 I like, uh, almost 60, which is seems pretty That's very nice. Varied, especially this time of year, but yeah. then it just goes down. Big drop. You know, when those seasons are changing, we're in November, we're going to see those changes. Uh, you know, that's it's that time of the year. It's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs> very much so.